Hey guys, uh, thought I'd give you a quick before and after. Uh, it's meant to be snowing stupidly heavily uh, tonight. I think Ruth is going to have to stay at um, over at her parents in the village. Uh, I don't think there's going to be any chance she's going to make it back uh, back here and back to work again tomorrow. Um, so I'll quickly show you outside now. So that's it at the moment, with a the cat there. So not looking too bad. You can't really see, there's the slightest speck of snow coming down every every now and then. But, um, no, it's all meant to come down tonight. So we'll see how bad it is tomorrow. And, um, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll show you then. Actually, better that a cat in really, isn't I? Don't know if you guys can see that, at the bottom of the garden. That was where I was growing vegetables, that was my little vegetable patch. Up until Branson and Pickle decided that that was their toilet. So that's now their toilet. And I have no veg. Little sods. Right, off to see Ruth now at her salon, so you'll actually get to see her, um, her salon as well. But um, no, it is starting to snow now. Um, She's left behind her phone charger. I think she's gonna have to stay at her parents because her parents live in the village where um, where her salon is. Um, so she can stay there for the night. And then that means she can get into work tomorrow. Um, because quite a lot, quite a lot of her ladies are local, so they'll be in anyway. But you know, it happens. Um, so I'll see you in a sec. Do you know what? One of the best things in summer when you drive into to Ruth's parents' house is the roads that you get to drive along because they're absolutely fantastic. Uh, but one of the worst things about driving to Ruth's in the winter is, um, is the roads because they're absolutely awful. You're just waiting to slide out or something. Because it's not main roads, it's country roads, they don't really get salted as much as anything else and they're quite wet as well. So you're just waiting to hit this ice patch. I haven't actually hit any yet. Um, it is cold enough for it, but I think it may may get worse over the next few days, over the next week or so, but there we go. Hello, this is my salon. I thought you might like to see it. I've told you lots about it, but obviously we started in September, so um, it's going really well, so I thought you might like to have a little look. And we've now got products in which makes the area look much better as well. Um, so over here, We've got, um, this is from Ikea, I love it. And um, all my stock is gradually being put in. So we've got my skincare here, Eve Taylor, and that's all my aromatherapy based products. So when they have their facials, they would have all of them. Um, and then over here, we've just started um, my me cosmetic makeup. So that's um, for retail, so they can buy that. Nice little packaging, I think, it's really pretty. And then we've got a little bit of Jessica down here. Some nice oils and uh, removal kits for gels. Um, and then... Can you buy the starfish in the glass? No, you can't buy the starfish in the glass. Oh, I want to buy the starfish in the glass. And nice little glass. bags for the products to go in, which always makes a difference. Uh, I want to buy the starfish. <laughs> oh, and then okay. by the window, oh. so this is where I do my displays and things. So you've got little um, lights and things to make it look really pretty. So we just got a little bit there about the makeup, that's a new thing. Um, then over here we've got the new makeup stand. Um, today's a bit of a strange day because I'm doing my makeup launch where people are coming in to have their makeup done and um, they, they've bought some products which is really good as well. So that looks really nice and they have a little sit here and I do all their makeup by the window so that's really nice. Um, and then over here we've got just where they come and sit for their treatment. Nice comfy seats, they get to read some magazines. Um, and then they choose from a menu of what drinks they'd like to have. So just a, quite a few there for them to choose from. <laughs> quite a wide choice of drinks. Yeah, quite a few. Um, but that makes it you know, all the better and people really like, like lots of options. Um, over here we've got um, my little reception desk. And there's colours here that they can buy as well, which is nice, just turn that. So um, we've got some music playing, I don't know whether you can hear it, but there we go. And then there's just a few of the price lists. And then all of Ruth's certificates as well up Many on the wall. Many certificates, 
<laughs> There's more as well, isn't there? Yeah. That could have gone up. But, Very um, proud of my Sedesco there. International qualification. Um, internationally this is my renowned. Little uh, price list there, which I did myself actually, so I'm quite pleased with that. So, adding things to that. Over here, it's a bit empty because I said it's not a normal day, so we're doing makeup. Um, over here, I always have the chair, the nice little white chair over there, and my stool, and we'd sit here and do nails and have the little lamp on. And they would sit here looking out the window, being nosy. <laughs> but no, not you know what I mean, but it's nice, it's all friendly, and they wave to their friends and things. Um, and then we go through over here. This is the treatment room, I've only got one at the moment. But um, we're, that's a work in progress, obviously. So I've um, got all my polishes there that I would use. Do you come around here? Yeah. All my polishes here that I'd use in treatments. Nice little glass trolleys, which I think makes a difference. All my waxing stuff. Um, and then over here, some of the Eve Taylor stuff. But I did have some over there just because I'm using that for the makeovers today. So I said not normal. Um, I've got a little mitt heater here. So all the mitts like this, they get dampened down and then you get nice hot mitts on your face for the facial. So really nice and relaxing. Nice glass trolley and a little crystal lamp. M music on in here as oh. well, isn't there? We've got some tunes. Oh, I don't know why it's not on. We'll turn it on. There Create the ambience. So music. Ambience. And then I do have this little blind to make it a bit cosier, but we do have frosting there, so no one can uh, actually see in. And then the bed um, goes up and down. It's a nice spa couch. You see, nice little duvet as well for when they have facials and things like that. So they're lovely and warm and cosy. Uh, that's my little stool where I sit. I'm going to turn the light off so you can see. Oh, actually, want to look at that nice picture there? Oh, of the sunset. Yeah. So it's all just really kind of boutique -y slash um, Bora Bora kind of thing, which I wanted. So we'll turn the light off and you can see what it's like for massages and facials. Not sure how much is going to come up on the, um, on the video there. But it's very prepare. relaxing with the candles. I don't know if you can see the pictures there. Pop back out. Here we are. And then this is just like our little bit, so we won't show you that, but when we get the other room in September, hopefully, then um, we'll show you what we're going to do with that. So I hope you like it. Um, let me know what you think. Fantastic. Yeah. Ruth won't let me get a cuckoo clock. She's being horrible. Tell her. Ruth, can I get a cuckoo clock? Why? Horrible. That's not an answer. You're not getting cookie cook. <sighs> I mean, obviously I have a vision. I'm good at making shops look good, so I know how to make house look good. Therefore, trust me. I think we should go for that green in the front room now. I think now you trust my judgment, I reckon you should go with my judgment on the green. A green cuckoo clock, I think that would look obviously awful. Obviously not a green, I just mean like a paint. Mm. Trust me, you've got to trust me. If it's really horrible, then we'll paint over it. And it's a wasted pot of paint, but I reckon we should try it. Mm. No. So I just got back from uh, Ruth's salon, and uh, the diet stuff's been delivered, and oh my god, it looks like there's loads, absolutely loads. So I'll have a quick look. Look at that. Two huge boxes that is up to well not far off waist waist height so I think we'll um, grab the knife and we'll have a, a quick look at what's inside so there's a knife here we go here we go all right let's have a look then oh what size best? Oh 
Ja. So. Yeah! Lots of air. Oh, I can't pop it. Woo! Alright, so, alright. Where are we going to put this? Let's put this on the table. Ah, so much food! No more in there. And loads down here. Oh, oh, oh. you spread out too much. And loads. All these. Well, do you know what? After going and seeing Ruth today at the salon and her showing us around, I'm so proud. I am so proud of it. I don't think I can explain how much. I'll have a go. But oh, this much, I am this proud. This proud. I kind of can't get any bigger. From this hand to that foot. That proud. Right, so we've just come back from Sainsbury's, uh, where we've done a shot for, for my, my healthy food. Uh, we're both starting the diet tomorrow, aren't we? Mm -hmm. um, so, top, you know, it's grud what do you call it? Grudge day? Starting day? I, d well, I, I don't know. Yeah, wh whatever it is. I'm really hungry. But, yeah. That's fine. Come on. But, right, Ruth's Ru really enjoying this one. Uh, so we thought we'd go all out and uh, get a McDonald's for our, for our last day of freedom. So, oh, didn't get too much. We got loads. Two burgers, two chicken, pie, three chips, some wrap thing, milkshakes. We got the lot. <laughs> so we just worked out how many calories were, was in our last meal sort of thing. <laughs> and Ruth, how many was in yours? Does it say there? 2,120? 2,120 calories. Not even a thousand. Oh, bigger ones coming. And then in mine, let me see, I took a. a, a, a saved, a, saved a picture of it. Come on then. Um, it's cold. 2,515 in mine. That's just on that one meal. That's not even. That's with nothing else during the day. Nothing else. Just 2,500. Doesn't even want to come in. Oh. Who's that? Picks. She outside, was she? Is it snowing again? Oh well. Mm -hmm. So, next time at McDonald's, work it out. Yes, work it out, it's not good. This is why we're going on diets, by the way. This is why Paul's put on two stone and I put on a stone. So it's I, a wedding. I wanted vegetable lasagna today, and Ruth said, oh no, let's let's have a McDonald's. I've got a great idea, we'll, we'll have a McDonald's, didn't we? Uh, Wait a minute, you were the first one to say, oh, actually, I think we could have a McDonald's for dinner because let's make the most of it. And I said, actually, I was going to say that as well. I thought they So did. I concurred, I agreed with you. Concurred, try that word, it's quite a good one. Concurred, I concurred. Concurred. It means I agree with you. Concurred. Okay. I'll try and teach you a new word every day. How's that? But I knew that one. Teach me a new word. Teach me a new word then. No, I went. I meant Maggie and, and Ben. Ah, uh, ah, uh, okay. Not you. Yeah, teach you. you. We'll you teach word. you another word. We'll, we'll teach you like something random. Yeah, every day. So I concur means I agree with you. Yeah. Another thing to learn. Don't be greedy at McDonald's. No, and make sure you think think about. Nobody, what you're gonna nobody have. wins at McDonald's. Nobody wins. Apart from Ronald McDonald. I hated myself. Alright, so we've just laid out all my um, my food for, for the upcoming week. We've only got a week's worth. Ruth has uh, a month's worth. Um, we've just gone to Sainsbury's, put it all up, um, and laid it all out. And it looks very healthy. Looks very healthy. So, set it all up into, into different days. And I've got some bread allowances, I've got some. 
slice of carrot cake per day. And got some red kidney beans and butter beans as well, just to bulk some stuff up. But um, no, hopefully I'll be um, be losing weight soon, get rid of the fat. And I think my aim is to um, start putting on some muscle again before I go to um, before we go to Orlando, aren't we? Um, but anyway, I'm gonna start packing all this away and I'm gonna say good night. Um, just say good night, Ruth. Night. Night.